हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ईसी एकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू फाइंड सिक्स पॉइंट डी एफ टी फॉर द गिवन सीक्वेंस एक्स ऑफ एन इज इक्वल टू वन वन जीरो 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 टू यूजिंग मेट्रिक्स मेथड व्हिच इज सेम एज लीनियर ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन मेथड टू फाइंड एन पॉइंट डी एफ टी वी कैन यूज द मेट्रिक्स एक्स एन इज इक्वल टू डब्ल्यू एन स्मॉल एक्स एन हियर दे हैव गिवन सिक्स पॉइंट डी एफ टी देर फोर लेट अस टेक एन इज इक्वल टू सिक्स नाउ लेट अस राइट द मेट्रिक्स फॉर दिस सो फर्स्ट वी नीड टू राइट सिक्स क्रॉस वन मेट्रिक्स सो वील राइट एक्स ऑफ जीरो एक्स ऑफ वन एक्स ऑफ टू एक्स ऑफ थ्री एक्स ऑफ फोर एंड एक्स ऑफ Five. This will be equal to. We need to write the matrix for the Tweedle factor W n. That will be six cross six matrix. So to write that matrix, you write here zero, one, two, three, four, and five. So here you write zero, one, two, three. Four and five. Zero multiplied with zero, it will be zero. So we will write W six because n value is equal to six here. W six to the power of zero. Again zero multiplied with all this value, it will be zero. So the power of W in this row will be zero. So we can write W six to the power of zero. W six to the power of zero. Here W six to the power of zero, W six to the power of zero, and W six to the power of zero. Again, in this column, if you multiply one with zero, it will be zero. Two with zero, zero, and all this value with zero, it will be zero. So it will be W six to the power of zero, 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 and W six to the power of zero. Now one multiplied with one, it is one W six to the power of one. One multiplied with two, it is W six to the power of two. One into three, it is three. W six to the power of three. One into four, it is four. W six to the power of four. One into five, it is five. W six to the power of five. Two into one, it is two. W six to the power of two. Two into two, it is four. W six to the power of four. Two into three, it is six. W six to the power of six. Two into four, it is eight. W six to the power of eight. Two into five, it is ten. W six to the power of ten. In the same way, you multiply three into one, it is W six to the power of three. Three two is a six. W six to the power of six. Three three is a nine. W six to the power of nine. Three four is a twelve. W six to the power of twelve. Three five is a fifteen. W six to the power of fifteen. Four multiplied with one, it will be W six to the power of four. Four two is a eight. W six to the power of eight. Four threes are twelve. W six to the power of twelve. Four fours are sixteen. W six to the power of sixteen. Four fives are twenty. W six to the power of twenty. Next, you multiply five with one. It will be five. W six to the power of five. Five twos are ten. W six to the power of ten. Five threes are fifteen. W six to the power of fifteen. Five fours are twenty. W six to the power of twenty. Five fives are twenty-five. W six to the power of twenty-five. So this is the six cross six matrix for the Twidel factor W E N. Along with this, we need to multiply with the matrix for small x n. So that will be six cross one matrix. So x of zero, x of one, x of two, x of three, x of four, x of five. Now we need to substitute the values for all these Twidel factor. We know W n can be given as e to the power of minus j two pi by n. Also, we know that W n to the power of zero is equal to one. So from this analysis, we can say W six to the power of zero will also be equal to one. Now we need to find different Tweedle factor values like W six to the power of one, W six to the power of two. W six to the power of three, 
W6 to the power of 4, W6 to the power of 5, W6 to the power of 6, W6 to the power of 8, W6 to the power of 9, W6 to the power of 10, W6 to the power of 12, W6 to the power of 15, W6 to the power of 16, W6 to the power of 20, W6 to the power of 25. Now to find the value for W6 to the power of 1, we can use the same formula here. So it is e to the power of minus j 2 pi by n into 1. So this we can write it as cos 2 pi by 6 minus j sin 2 pi by 6. So if you use calculator for this, let us keep the calculator in complex and radians mode. You write cos 2 pi by 6 minus i sin 2 pi by 6. So it is 0 0.5 shift equals the imaginary part is minus 0 0.5. 866j so this is the value for w6 to the power of 1 in the same way if you calculate for w6 to the power of 2 using the same formula you will get minus 0.5 minus 0.866j for w6 to the power of 3 you will get minus 1 w6 to the power of 4 it will be minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.886 j for w6 to the power of 5 it is 0 0.5 plus 0 0.886 j w6 to the power of 6 it will be 1 for w6 to the power of 8 it will be minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j for w6 to the power of 9 it is minus 1 w6 to the power of 10 it is minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.886 j w6 to the power of 12 it is 1 w6 to the power of 15 it is minus 1 w6 to the power of 16 it is minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.886 j for w6 to the power of 20 it will be minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.886 j and w6 to the power of 25 it is 0 0.5 minus 0 0.886 j now let us substitute all these twiddle factor value in this matrix so we can write wherever w6 to the power of 0 is there we can write it as 1 1 1 1 1 1 now we need to substitute for w6 to the power of 1 w6 to the power of 1 is 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j w6 to the power of 2 is minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j w6 to the power of uh, 3 is minus 1 w6 to the power of 4 is minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j w6 to the power of 5 is 0 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j w6 to the power of 2 is Again, minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j. W6 to the power of 4 is minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j. W6 to the power of 6 is 1. W6 to the power of 8 is minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j w6 to the power of 10 is minus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j likewise you fill all the total factor values after writing all the total factor values you write the values for x of 0 up to x of 5 
so x of 0 is 1, x of 1 is 1, x of 2 is 0, x of 3 is 0, x of 4 is 0, x of 5 is 2. Now if you multiply the first row with this matrix, so it will be 1 into 1 plus 1 into 1 plus 1 into 0 plus 1 into 0 plus 1 into 0 plus 1 into 2. So we will get 4. Now using the calculator, we can multiply this second row with this column. So it will be 1 into 1, 1 into 1 plus the second value 0 0.5 minus 0 0.86 j into 1. So it will be 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j plus minus 1 into 0 it will be 0 plus this term multiplied with 0 it will be 0 plus the last term multiplied with 2 so it is 0 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j into 2 so if we calculate we will get 2.5 shift equals plus 0 0.866 j. In the same way if you multiply third row with this matrix you will get minus 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j. Fourth row multiplied with this matrix you will get minus 2. Fifth row multiplied with this matrix you will get minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j and the last row multiplied with this matrix you will get 0 0.5 minus j 0 0.866 j so finally we can write x of k is equal to 4 comma 2.5 plus 0 0.866 j comma minus 0.5 plus 0 0.866 j comma minus 2 comma minus 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j comma 0 0.5 minus 0 0.866 j so this is the dft for the given sequence this is the standard matrix for 6 point DFT. Even though if you don't calculate these values, if you remember this matrix, you can directly substitute this matrix value. Otherwise, if you get confused, you can use this calculation method to find each Tweedle factor value to write the matrix for Tweedle factor. I hope you have understood the topic. Thank you.